Hi everyone, Michaela here with your 10 minute strong arms for arm balances class. We're gonna to be toning and sculpting the arms in a way that will help us with our arm balances in our yoga practice. We're gonna do intervals of 45 seconds on and 15 seconds rest. So let's get started. Okay, for our first exercise, we have got tricep dips on our knees into child's pose. Ready? Let's go. Now I am doing it on my knees here because we will be doing this for 45 seconds. Good, I want you to squeeze those elbows into the side body. Good, strengthening and toning through the back of our arms here. Good, making sure our breath is flowing. All right, next movement. Find your downward dog here. We've got eight shoulder raises. And then walk your feet in and walk them back out. Let's go. Eight, seven, six shoulders to the ears. Four, three, two. Hold the shoulders to the ears as you walk your feet in as much as you can for your own body. And walk it back out, downward dog. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, hold the shoulders up, walk it in, and walk it out. Eight, seven, six, five, four. All right, so we've got our next exercise here. Find plank position, right knee scoops, and we wanna scoop into the belly, into our chest, and lift the hips here, then move to the other leg, here we go. Good, you wanna exhale, draw the knee in. Inhale, step it back. Exhale, draw it in. Inhale, back. Good, so you even wanna come onto the tiptoes here so we can really lift the hips. Good, push the floor away with your hands. Good, you even wanna see a scoop through the chest here. So you might wanna see those shoulders come forward and up as we scoop. All right, this next one is a toughie. Moving through a yoga flow here. We've got chaturanga, hold for four seconds, knees up or down, upward dog, Downward dog, repeat, let's go. Find your chaturanga, elbows into the side body. Four, three, two, one. Good, upward dog and downward dog. Good, high plank, find your chaturanga. Squeeze those elbows in, four, three, two, one. Good, upward dog, downward dog. Good, remembering in our chaturanga, if we need to drop those knees, then we can, but challenge yourself here. Push yourself, two, one. Good, upward dog, and downward dog. Good, high plank, good. All right, let's find dolphin pose here. We're coming onto our elbows. Tailbone reaches to the sky, shift the weight forward. Tap the nose or the forehead between your hands then shift the weight back. Let's go. Shift it forward and back. Good, so of course you wanna gently, gently top your forehead or nose. Really resist and control. You're gonna start to feel this one in your shoulders. Good. 
Get those hips up. Whew, feel the burn here. All right. So for our next movement, we have plank. Step your feet in, find a little ball with the body and step your feet out, high plank. Ready? Let's go. So tiny steps in, good. Find a little ball, scoop, scoop, scoop through belly and chest and take it back. Good. Good, press away from the floor here. Fingertips are spread wide. Good, flat line in that plank when you find it. Steps in, scoop. Maybe your weight is shifting forward a little bit here for extra challenge. Good, baby steps back. Whew, this one is a good one for crow pose. Working those exact muscles that you need. Good, for our next movement, come onto your forearms. We've got rocking forward and back, then scoop back to center. Ready? Let's go, rock forward, come onto your tiptoes, back, scoop the belly, good, center. Rocking forward and back and scoop and center. Good, a lot of shoulder work in our class today. Good, but those are the muscles that you need for your arm balances to hold up your body weight. Lots of shoulders, lots of triceps. Good. All right. Good, so come on to our hands um, and sit your bum onto your heels. Now we're going to lift our hips and knees into Lalasana position. Here we go. Up, scoop the belly, push away from the floor and down. Now we're on the tops of our toes here. You wanna scoop, good, push away and down. Good. Good, it helps me to exhale as we come up. And inhale down. Good, now as, as you advance into this move, then we'll maybe take off one foot, then the other, maybe even both feet. But for today, we're just staying on our toes. I'm working the core. All right, flip around onto our bum. Good, feet are hip width here out in front of us. We've got tricep dips and then tapping opposite hand to knee or to your toes. Alternating legs. Let's go. Good, now don't worry if you're not finding your balance right away, just take it slow. It might take you a second to find where your center needs to be. Final exercise, we've got reverse plank. Legs together, we lift those hips and find a flat line with the body. Here we go. Good, so you wanna press away from the floor, squeeze the glutes. Good, net your ribs in. And just focus on your breath here. Focusing on lifting from the glutes, lifting from the hamstrings. Good, and lengthen long through your neck. 
So you've got it. Nearly done. 10 seconds. Got to lift those hips higher. All right. Thank you so much for joining me in our arm strengthening class today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on my Instagram account, Fit by Mick. I'll see you all next time.